job of transporting wounded men is not easy at the best of times, but when there is a cliff face to be negotiated, it is very difficult. However, troops in Northern Ireland learn how to sling casualties down without bumping them against the cliff. They only want a snappy lift girl to call going down to make everything perfect. It's quite a different matter when a river has to be crossed. First, a swimmer has to take a line from one bank to the other. This river is 92 yards across and very deep, so he can't do it with one foot on the bottom. Arriving at the other side, his job is to haul across logs fastened to the line he's brought over. The idea is that these logs are put up in the form of a tripod, matching a similar affair on the opposite bank. Now a gadget is fixed so that it will run along the taut wire. In this case, an American doughboy volunteered to be taken for a ride. If he were at home, he'd probably have to pay for the sensation on one of the coasters at Colney Island. Looking up gives us a strange upside down feeling, if you know what I mean. Well, that was a pretty comfortable trip, and it just goes to show how easily a casualty can be transported across a river. Our volunteer gets a free cigarette too. He's not sorry he came. 